Hi everyone, my name is Moni. And I'm Naveen from Before You Play. And today we have another playthrough for you. This time it is for a two-player only game called Aqualin. This one's designed by Marcelo Bertocci and published by Cosmos. And it is a two-player only abstract strategy game where one person is going to be competing for color and the other for species of animals. Yes. So this is a game that is a part of their two-player line specifically. And mm -hmm. Cosmos is very well known for that two-player line. They typically release at least uh, one game as a part of that line per year. But I believe last year they did not. From what we understand, 2021, there was not a two-player mm -hmm. game. This is a 2020 release. Yes, but this is also their most recent and one yes. that we hadn't played until now. Mm -hmm. So we figured, you know, it's been a while since we've done a, a playthrough. And uh, what better way to kind of get ourselves back into <laughs> to the groove than with a game like this, yep. right? So uh, as per usual, we are going to start with a, a really, really quick teach of the game because mm -hmm. the rules are, are pretty simple. And then go into a full two-player playthrough and then discuss um, our experience. But before we begin, if you like these kind of videos and want to see more in the future, please consider subscribing. And with that, we are ready to get started. So if you'd please direct your attention to the set of the table, we're all set up here for our two-player only game of Aqualin. Yes. And as you can see, uh, there are not that many components. <laughs> as of right now. Yeah, just, mm -hmm. just give you a little land. We have here the reef. This is the main board where we're going to be playing tiles too. And uh, this is our starting draft of, of cool. tiles, yep. our pool that we can choose from. Mm -hmm. And so the game comes with 36 of these tiles. They are all unique in the sense that each tile is going to be of one of six colors and of one of six different uh, ocean species. species. Yep. And so the way that the game works is one player will be scoring for the colors. Which is going to be me today. Yes, and I will be scoring for the animals. And so on your turn, you're going to choose a tile from the draft pool and place it onto the reef. And so for the first uh, turn of the game, we're essentially just going to be placing them anywhere we want. Mm -hmm. And then every time you place a tile, you refill the draft pool from the tiles that we have in the bag. <laughs> yes, this game does not come with this bag. Yes. Uh, but we are using a bag from another uh, game. Exactly. And uh, that's it. And so maybe for the second turn, somebody placed uh, this blue tile right there, that would get refilled. Then as soon as any tiles actually are present on the board, before you choose another tile to place onto the board, you can optionally move one tile as many spaces in a straight line mm -hmm. as you can essentially. Yep. So if this were uh, Naveen's turn, before he places a tile, he may want to move uh, the turtle uh, down this way next to this fish yep. because at the end of the game he's going to score points depending on how large his contiguous areas of the same colors are. Mm -hmm. So yeah my ultimate goal is to try to get as many of the same colors together orthogonally adjacent. Exactly and if it wasn't uh, a clear we're going to be alternating placing tiles onto the board. Mm -hmm. The game is going to end once all 36 tiles have been placed and so the board will be completely filled with mm -hmm. tiles and at that point we're going to score points uh, depending on how many of these contiguous areas that we have. For Naveen, again, it's going to be colors. And mm -hmm. for me, it's going to be species of animals. In the end of the game, uh, because there's a maximum of six total of each type of species or color, the maximum amount of points, if you have six all grouped together, is 15. Mm -hmm. And then it tapers down. Um, it would be 15, 10, 6, 3, 1. And if you have one isolated color or species, then you get no points. Right. So uh, that that six grouping is pretty impossible to yeah. get. You mm -hmm. did something it's, wrong it's if, <laughs> if somebody else did that. Yeah. Or something very right, right? Yep. So we're going to go ahead and get cleaned up, and then we'll get started. Okay, so we've cleared off the board. We have shuffled and put out six random tiles, and now we just have to figure out who is going to go first. Ready? Uh, what do you want to do, odds and evens? Yes. Okay. Uh, odds for me. Okay. One, two, three. Okay, evens. I'm first. That you are is... first. That's not, that's not a bad thing. That might be a bad thing. It's very <laughs> early. <laughs> All right. So again, colors and animals. Yes. All right. Here we go. All right. I'm going to go ahead and start by placing this uh, crabby crab. Well, you know what? I'm animals, huh? You are animals. There are two turtles. Do I put a turtle out now? <laughs> that's the question. You, you could, but it might entice me to do something I'm else with the other one. I'm going with the crabby one. crab. Yeah. <laughs> I'll place a crab right there. Okay. And then we refill. Right. So this so. gets refilled. First turn is very straightforward. Naveen's okay. turn. That's I felt like I overthought that turn. Totally did. <laughs> First tile. <laughs> you did. Okay, so I will I will take, uh, let's go ahead and I'll take the turtle. And we'll just put it right here. Okay. I'm not going to move this crab because uh, we'll see where the game goes. Let's place them all in, in one. Let's have them all kind one of direction. standing okay. face up. You got it. You don't need to do that, but you know. <laughs> For aesthetics. For aesthetics, exactly. Okay. Oh, we have so many turtles out now. Mm. You know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to get some turtle groupages going. So sure. now I have myself a contiguous grouping of turtles. If this stays the way that it is, by the end of the game, I will get one point. One point. But I highly doubt one <laughs> that glorious it stay point. in that configuration. Yes. Okay. Starfish. Blue starfish. Well, uh, seeing as I have no vested interest in this, <laughs> I'm going to just move this as far as I can. So the rules for moving it is uh, 
until you hit another tile or to hit the edge. So I'm gonna move it all the way to this edge. And now let's But you move. don't have to go all the way. I don't have to. You yeah. can stop short. Oh, so sorry, you yes. moved it like there if I you want to. It just has to be in the same row or column. That's right. And uh, I'm gonna take this kind of jellyfish and <laughs> place it here. Ah, so now you've got your now own Now I've grouping. got something going on. Not liking that. <laughs> I feel like it's not gonna be around for much longer. You know what? I'm gonna move this back. Yep. Yep, let's do that. And then, I need a diversion. <laughs> you yeah. know what? This can be amicable. Amicable. It we could, can make this it amicable. Could, it could be. I'm Depends gonna go on ahead what you do. Place that jellyfish right there. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> mm. All right. Well, we gotta refill. Not a fan There's of a that. A lot of refilling move. here. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Okay. So I will just send this uh, turtle on back. Stop it. <laughs> yeah. And uh, the turtle doesn't Amicable, approve. you say? Yeah. Okay. Let's go ahead and toss this star here. Wow. Starfish. I don't think that's what I meant by being amicable, <laughs> but... Uh, I'm working. There you go. You know what we could do <laughs> is uh, we could move the turtle this way. Yeah. If you really want that red turtle to stay there, we can do that. <laughs> um, and then I need to change color here. <laughs> that's what needs to happen. Okay. I'm giving away my secrets. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and plop this fish right there. We've got the fish. The fish is now in the game. This the is big the game. fish in the reef has arrived. All right, new tile. <laughs> it is a blue crab. Ooh, okay. Blue crab. Uh, all right, you've got some blue presents. We've got some crab presents. I do. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, let's put this seahorse here. <laughs> wow. I, well, before I, I can move something, actually. Oh, so, you didn't do that yet? Yeah, I didn't do that yet. Let's uh, let's just do this here. Oh my God, you're so <laughs> and, yeah. and then now I'll put this over here. Awful. Uh, Let's put it there. Okay, and this is your new tile right here. All right. Red starfish. Oh no, this is too good. <laughs> this is I'm I'm snoozing on that. I think you should you should bring in uh, some blue. You know what? I'm just gonna move this back. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and place. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. My other turtle Locked there, in. so that at least we're three for three, right? Yeah, that's true. A little okay. bit of a tie. Very good. All right. Let's got? see. Ooh, yellow fish. The, the further and further this gets filled, the more stressful this it becomes. It does, yeah. Right now it's pretty open. Uh, um, well, I will move this fish up. Okay. And then I'll move this starfish there. Ugh. Yeah. Gosh, how do I get you next to you? A lot of work. Awful. Ooh, lots of yellow. All right, I'm going to move this <laughs> okay. over one. Okay. <laughs> Plop this one right uh, there. Ugh. No. That's not bad, right? That's, yeah, that's pretty yeah, good. Yeah, that's not bad. Yep. So we get a refill? Yep. Oh, boy. Okay. Not what I wanted. <laughs> so how many tiles do we have here? It was five. Uh, Eleven? Eleven, yeah. Right, about so a third got, away. We've got some time. About... Okay, I'll, well, I'll just slide this turtle up. Let's just go way wow. far away. That stinks. Let's do that. And then uh, let's just go ahead and get this crab working. <laughs> Look at the crab working here. I feel like that crab's not going to hang out there for much longer than that, though. Gosh. So we got to get him moving. Horrible. There we go. Well, I'm going to move this back. Okay. Just a little bit closer. Just a little closer. You okay. know what? That's such a terrible idea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know what? I'm going to break this apart. Mm, mm -hmm. That is what you get. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't very yeah, nice. That's but... not nice. Um, <laughs> Something had to change. Yeah, that was pretty good. <laughs> That was pretty good. We can't we can't just keep building up our own school. Yeah. You know. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna move this starfish because it's kind of in in no man's land. So I'll put it all the way up there. Okay. And then let's just plop this red fish. Oh no. Okay. Let's plop <laughs> this squid since you've blocked in these uh, like squids or octopus. What is I it? Think jellyfish. It's a, we're gonna go with jellyfish. Jellyfish. Yeah. Stay with jellyfish. Stick with jellyfish. We'll put that right there. Oh gosh. Okay. You know, I, I think it's time to abandon the jellyfish. Yep. All right, I'm gonna try to make some of the crabs happen somehow. I'm gonna yeah. move this over. Okay. Kind okay. of abandoning everything <laughs> and just gonna go for the crabs. Go right there. Little crab move. There you go. Well, okay. So now I gotta hmm. refill. Yeah, I gotta refill. Well, let's go ahead and uh, protect this crab slightly. Do that. <laughs> And, um, As if it's in danger. Yeah. And now that I know your crab intentions, <laughs> let's go ahead and <laughs> take, 
purple crab. Stay away. And just tuck it right here. So it's a little bit uh, separated from these ones. Wow, that was a nasty move. Yeah. <laughs> uh, More purple. Gosh, I've made some mistakes. No, I mean, yeah. We've created kind of like these difficult to manage uh, pathways. They're micro communities, yeah. I would <laughs> I like to think. Okay, let's move this one. Mm. Let's bring that crab to that one, just so we can break these guys up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was my, that's my initial just something. <laughs> it's no longer You gotta a thing. start somewhere, yeah. right? And then I'm gonna go ahead and plop uh, a good old starfish right there, nice. just to kind of keep the crabs. Yeah. Over in that yeah, direction. Yeah, in their crab pots. Okay, so... We need another tile. We need something that's real ideal. What do you want? I don't know. What color? I actually don't know what I need. Well, you're going to get a, a jellyfish. Red jellyfish. Well, I think I'm going to move this crab on over. <laughs> there. Oh! Yeah. I didn't even notice that. Good job. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, let's just keep it kind of locked in a little bit with this yellow fish. Keep it in the family? Yes. I think that looks pretty good. Oh. Uh, not good. Seahorse. Okay. I have some fears about this. I just don't know what to do about it quite <laughs> yet. So I'm going to bring this down. Yeah, that's nice. And then I'm going to plop my good old, good old turtle oh, right nice. there. So you got three turtles and they're pretty much locked in. It's a lot of moving parts. That's the hope. That is uh, the hope. You know, that is, it, it does get a little tougher once things kind of get cornered out. Compressed, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, but, let's see what we got. Oh, there's a purple turtle. Ah. Purple turtle. One turn short. Interesting. Would have been nice to add that turtle to the family. <laughs> yeah. I don't like my reds are se uh, separated. Okay, let's go ahead and break up this little starfish <laughs> here. Okay. And I'm going to bring in this seahorse and place it right there. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. We have a yellow oh. starfish. I like it. I see you trying to protect this. I'm going to move this back <laughs> just one over. Okay. And I'm going to uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> take that yellow. When that, when I, that came out, I was like, oh, <laughs> shoot, I'm not in control of that one. And I was like, perfect uh, timing. You know, terrible. that was like one step away for you, too. Terrible. Okay. All right, Naveen, you got purple and you got red. <laughs> I do. What are you going to work on? I mean... I mean, there's a lot of possibility with the red right now. You only is... have two red right there. Yes. But they are separated from everything. The earlier things come out, mm -hmm. the riskier they are. Like, yeah. You really can't hold on to them. No, right? you can't so. defend everything. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm just going to move this right on back, right there, <laughs> buy myself some time. And then uh, let's go ahead and put this starfish, because I cannot let you control another one. And let's just tuck that in right over here. Uh, yeah. Hi. Okay, it's, getting, it's coming down now. Last couple. All right, I'm going to go ahead and move this back. We're playing past the starfish. Mm -hmm. And, uh, oh, I have two options. You know, I'm going to go with the jellyfish. Okay. I'm going to go yeah. ahead and place that right there. Secure that yeah. that jellyfish positioning. That's good. Get the purple out the way. Out the way. Right? Shoot. <sighs> ah, pink. Pink is not really working for me here. So let's what? do... What? So... Pink is working for you. What do you mean? <laughs> not really working for me. <laughs> the you. possibilities are endless. Let's go right back, because I cannot let you have that little grouping. Now now I can I can do this, I think, though. And just like, I, there's no way I'm going to be able to protect that and get that yellow starfish. So let's just keep those as a three. And this is just all by itself now. Oh my God. So that it can't be used so... and it's protecting the, the yellows. Annoying. <laughs> Jeez Louise. All right. So since this starfish is a little bit, uh, um, dead to you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> for lack of a, a better phrase, uh -huh. I'm going to move this over okay. and make some way for a fishy <sighs> fish combo Fishies. yeah I, I gave this to you. you 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 can you can keep it well played um, okay <laughs> so you're good with that huh yes okay going with that okay for such a cute simple game this is quite stressful it is <laughs> all right let's move this one up then to okay. break that up and then how do i want to do this yes how do you want to do this naveen uh, don't you wish that that last yellow tile came out right then <laughs> yes <laughs> I do. <laughs> that would probably be... That would be pretty good. Ideal. I will take this turtle, purple, mm -hmm. and place it here. <laughs> okay. Stinks. <laughs> <laughs> Stinky turtle, huh? That's pretty awful. There we go. Okay, well, I mean, I think I really have no choice. You kind of push my hand with that here. Okay. So I will move nasty turtle that way and plop myself a fish. 
right in there. Mm -hmm. So come on. Right, so we only have a few more spots. Come on, yellow. Find you, yellow. Yellow. Oh, it's not <laughs> yellow. <laughs> Was that a diversion? <laughs> yes, to buy myself some time. Yeah. For that yellow. Because all like all I need to do is this and just undo that fish thing that you're doing, and then plop the yellow fish or plop whatever yellow it was. So if I do this, th all the fish are technically broken up. None of them are connected, but it doesn't help sure. me. If I put this purple here, it's the same difference. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's just move that out of the way. Okay. And somehow break up this fish party. So let's. Uh, <laughs> it's a school. I think I got to put a red in here. So let's just put the seahorse. Yeah, because these jellyfish are the yeah jellyfish are all kind of blocked in. So not too concerned about them. You've angered <laughs> the animal side. Yeah. So I'm gonna have to do something. Come on, be good. Desperate times. Ooh, there's that jellyfish. All right. Well then, let's break up your yellow. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I did that. What do I want to put there? I okay. guess the seahorse sea makes horse? the most sense. Yeah. Yeah. It's unfortunate. Right there. Wow. Not good. <laughs> so at least the seahorse ties with your, your color right there. No, the yellow is not in, in play yet. Yellow is going to be last. Uh. <laughs> Just going to be. So how many spaces do we have left? Five, six, seven? So there should only be. That, the yellow is The last. yellow is the one in the bag. Yeah. <laughs> wow. I know. Amazing. I know. So if it wasn't clear, we pretty much play all the rest of the tiles out. Even if there are no more tiles left in the bag, we finish all the tiles that are left in the draft pool. Mm -hmm. And then we'll score. So very close. And the funny thing is, I know exactly which one. It, it, it It's the yellow seahorse, right? Yeah, because... you, can, you can tile count. So definitely. the thing is, like, knowing the yellow seahorse is in here, I really want to move this here. But if I do, that leaves that hole right there for you to create more seahorse, like a seahorse I mean, it's a there. yellow seahorse, so it'll be... Nice yeah, it's not good. <laughs> not good. So I'll move this tile here. Okay. And then I think I'm going to take this pink crab and just plop it right in there. <gasps> I was in. ignoring that area. Yeah, and we know this should be yellow seahorse, oh, otherwise we awful. have a problem. Okay, good. <laughs> yellow seahorse. Good. Oh my gosh, I'm disappointed in that spot. <sighs> Had to do it. Oh, and Naveen, you're, you're looking good here. You've Am got I? three, three, three. Do you ha does anybody have anything more than three? I don't think so. No, okay, that's good. That yeah. feel better. <laughs> you're in a good position. Good. <laughs> <sighs> oh, okay, all right, I'm going to move this fish over. And uh, might as well play that seahorse right there, mm, right? Nice. Probably a good uh, good idea. Yeah, it's not bad. Um, ooh. So that's it. This, this doesn't get refilled. We're gonna no. play out these last last five tiles. If I move this fish over, it breaks up the fish you created, and I can plop in a red. Oh god. Yeah, let's do it. Let's move that over. That breaks this whole thing up, but it also doesn't let you get these starfish in. <laughs> yeah. And then uh, I think the best thing to do is probably oh this crab, so you can't then use it on the outside. And he talks through his moves, <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> to make sure I know that I can't use it. Yeah, just to <sighs> move it along. Well, then I'm gonna break this up. Yeah, you might as well. Might as well. Is it true? Do I mm, might as well? I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just gonna do a one over and place this jellyfish in there. Sure, yeah. Wow, it's interesting because all of the spaces are just in a row. Mm -hmm. Right? It's not just like <laughs> yeah. a space here, space there. Yeah. Oh, it's this just is... isn't centered in one. So this area is like locked in. It's just centered in that one spot. It, yeah. It's interesting because this turtle and this fish all will score you a point if I go there with it. Okay. I'll move up. Okay. And I'll drop this one right in there. Oh, no. There we go. How could I let that happen? <laughs> yeah. Oh, my gosh. That's so disappointing. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you could score a point Awful. by just dropping something in here. I'm sure there's an ideal move that I'm supposed to make right now because this is my final turn, but I cannot think of what it is. So I th actually... Is there a way? Yeah, to... I think if I move this over. Okay. And then I put um, the turtle there. Okay. That'll at least take away the blue combo. Yeah. Right? The only thing is I, I can then just plop this in here and get the point. Back. Yeah. So yeah. instead of giving you the green and the blue, mm -hmm. you only get the green. Uh, just the green, yeah. Yeah. So the game is now over. Uh, we're going to calculate our final scores, starting with colors, Color. is what okay. the rule book says. So yes. we're going to go with colors, and I'm just going to go ahead and use a calculator sure, to yeah. score this. So let's start with blue. Dark blue. Okay, that's the one I think I'm not scoring anything. Blue, 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 blue. They're all isolated. They're all isolated. Zero. That's a good way to start Never want to score zero on any category. <laughs> that's not good. All right, let's go with green. Yeah, my greens are only these one. All right. A contiguous pairing scores one point. Yes. All right, so pink. I'm at one point right now, so I get... Uh, three of these, so that's uh, uh, three points. Yep. 
and then a set of, of two, which is one point, so four points. Okay, so you're at five. Five points total, okay. Uh, purple, I have this three right here, so okay. it's another three. Another three. Red? Yeah, red is my, my biggest one, I think. That's a four. Okay, so four scores, six points. Mm -hmm. So now you're at 14. Yes, and my yellow, my only ones are this one, so it's another three. So 17. 17, Naveen. Oh, uh, that's not good. I, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> okay, well, Oof. we're going to find out. Okay. So now we're going to score for me, and um, I'm going to be scoring for the contiguous grouping of species, starting with crab. crab. So, so I see it's a little crabs. bit harder to see the, fit, the, the animals, I will say, mm -hmm. but two crab. crabs. Okay, so that's uh, one. Isolated, isolated. Isolated, yeah. Okay, I think it's just that one, right? What? Oh, no. Well, okay. I scored zero on my first category. That's true. So, so uh, the next one is what? Uh, the fish? Yes. Okay, so fish, nothing. We've got a, a pairing here. One. For one. These are broken up. Yeah. Broken up. One broken isolated up. there. So it's another... Oh, no. <laughs> Good. <laughs> so two points <laughs> two so points, far. yes. All right, next up is jellyfish. Mm -hmm. And it looks like... I, I think it's just these four, right? Where's yeah. the other jellyfish? Uh, there's one here, and then if one is by itself, then one is by itself just okay. because of that Oops. reason. Yep. So four will score me six points. Six points, okay. So, so that's you have eight, eight so far. Yes. All right, and then seahorse. This is by itself. We've got one two. And another. And a three. So a three so and a four two. Total. So three points for this, one for that. Okay, so I'm at 12. Wow. Okay, 12 to 17 so far. Uh, the next one, I believe, is the starfish. So then starfish, we have three here. One, one, one. Okay, so just oh another three. Oh no. Okay, so it's 15. 15 to 17 with one to score. And you have the turtles. Oh no. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> one, two, three, four. I think you get four points here. One, two, three, four, five. Where the, my other turtle is probably it's, by itself. It's isolated right? somewhere. Okay, so it's yeah. one point for that, three for that. So plus oh, yeah, his four. 19. 19. Oh, shoot. It's really close. That was that good is... that you uh, took away a point from me then. Well, you did it somewhere else also. I need these jellyfish. 19 to 17. 19 17. The species prevail. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Very good. Wow, our scores were low. Yeah. Um, in the, the previous, the most recent plays of this, we were scoring in the 20s. In the low but... 20s, but yeah, that's why when I scored 17, I was like, oh, I don't think I did very well. Yeah. But that's it. Very that good. is the well entire done. game of Auckland. If you want to, you could play best out of three. Mm -hmm. So it is such a fast game that you could continue playing more rounds of this and see who the, the master of Auckland <laughs> of, the, of the seas uh -huh. is, right? Yes. Uh, we have played a few games that were a part of the, the two-player series uh, through Cosmos. Mm -hmm. And we actually did a mini-series on that, yeah. kind of like earlier uh, in our channel. Yeah, we I like covered, I think, Targi. We did... Uh... Oh, what's the other one? Um, we did... Um, duel. Uh, Imhotep the Duel. Imhotep the Duel. Yeah. We also covered Kahuna. Mm -hmm. And I believe we have a playlist on our channel. Yes. So if you're interested in checking out any of those games, uh, feel free. But how did you feel about this one? Yeah, so normally I don't like abstract strategy games, but this one, just That's with right. the, the yeah. simple mechanisms of what you're doing and uh, the fact that there's a duality of scoring, but each one of our tiles encompasses what we're trying to score for the other person or trying to avoid them scoring. Um, I like it, actually. I like it a lot. We've played it a handful of times now. Uh, we played it wrong <laughs> the first time we yeah. played. We didn't have the uh, the six, uh, the tiles six tile face up as That's a drafting pool. A huge deal. Yeah, we were just <laughs> randomly drawing one from the bag and making a decision. So um, it's more clever this way, definitely, for yeah, sure. Yeah, way better with uh, the drafting pool, for sure. But uh, yeah, I, I really enjoy this one. Uh, it's uh, very simple to teach. Um, a lot of different moving parts in the game in terms of literally moving the, the different tiles mm -hmm. around. Uh, it's a very enjoyable experience. I like it. Yeah. Yourself? So I will say that the first time I read, we read through these rules, um, it's, it sounds very simple. And even when somebody teaches it to you, it doesn't sound like there's a whole lot to it. But once you start playing, it's really clever. It's yeah. quite uh, strategic. It's constant offense defense. You know, this is two player only. Mm -hmm. And so you're trying to you're trying to think of your own scoring while trying to break apart your your opponent's scoring, but you don't have that much time. It's a very fast game and space is very limited. Yeah. It's very tactical. Mm -hmm. And uh, for that reason, I think it's it's actually very good. This is a very 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 well uh, designed game in its elegance and simplicity. Mm -hmm. yeah. Um this is definitely something that we played the first time and we were like, "Huh. That that's cool. That was Even cool. though we played it wrong, yeah. Yeah, that was cool. And then when we, we put in the actual, the real rules, <laughs> yeah. then we liked it a whole lot better. More, so this yeah. is something that we are adding to our collection mm -hmm. uh, to keep in there. It fits a very nice spot, right? It does, yeah. It can be in and out in about 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. uh, somebody comes over for game night, mm -hmm. and uh, let's say you have 
another game playing and he's like hey you want to learn a, a quick little game to kind of get yeah. this ready this is a perfect one that you can sit down with somebody definitely and basically say like here here's a quick rule set let's just play this real quick hopefully they wrap up their game and we can all get back together mm -hmm. so uh, yeah i like this one a lot components wise uh the tiles are really really cute mm -hmm. <laughs> it looks really really nice i will say it doesn't come with a bag so yeah. the kind of what we did is something that i would probably recommend put all the tiles in the bag so you that can. you can just yeah the, uh, pull from them the game basically says to flip everything face down so it, mm -hmm. it doesn't take a bad with space so that yeah. is very so uh, that's fine easy too. also but um we like um, it with the bag but i will say uh it, if you are playing as the animal player it is hard to see the animals it, it can be a to... little bit harder yeah um, for, for us at least uh for us the seeing the color is much easier mm -hmm. it just kind of pops up but other than that if you're on the lookout for uh clever strategic two-player games this is one that i would highly recommend you know mm -hmm. this is the the newest one like we we're saying in the the line of strategy games and one of the quicker ones to play that are come out from cosmos mm -hmm. right yep and so that is aqualin from cosmos games in their two-player series um, if you are interested in seeing other games that we did cover in the two-player series there is a link to the playlist uh, down in the description and also if you do like these kind of videos and want to see more in the future please consider subscribing thank you Thanks. bye